Hello guys, in this video we're going to create uh, a login uh, mobile for uh, um, an iOS screen and um, so let's start by creating uh, an artboard which uh, we're going to select uh, a Apple device and we're going for this uh, iPhone 8. So the first thing we're going to do is to create the main text which um, I'm creating over here, which is login, oops, login, here we go. And uh, let's use zero for this character. And uh, I'm going to center this one up. And I'm also going to center it uh, relative to the artboard so that uh, it's nice and uh, centered. So after that, uh, I'm going to create uh, a, a rounded rectangle. Um, so this is going to be the actual uh, input of the login. And um, I'm going to delete the feel and uh, I'm going to make the borders just a little bit bigger. So it's two pixels of thickness. And um, I'm going to make the a slight tint of gray to this and um, also let's use a radius of four so that it's not completely um, angled at the uh, at the edges but um, the corners are just a little bit smooth I'm also going to center this one up so that's it, that way it's nice and centered and uh, now we're going to uh, create the emo text so I'm gonna duplicate this one and uh, let's make it smaller let's make it uh, around uh, yeah maybe, maybe 15 pixels that, that can be good and uh, I'm going to make it left aligned uh, line it over here and uh, one thing that, uh, that I like to do is to make uh, in this case the email just a little bit uh, um, less bold so in this case I'm using Lato font which is uh, a Google free web font and um, I really like it for user interface design I think it's, it's really nice and um, it's um, uh, weights are pretty uh, usable I, um, especially for um, UI design, I, I tend to use the regular and the bold versions, sometimes the light versions, um, especially when I'm doing some um, like uh, other type of works, maybe like a big headline, but yeah, that's, that's that. So I'm going to duplicate this uh, and uh, in this uh, field, I'm going to enter the password and uh, this is uh, pretty much it for uh, this uh, main top section. I'm also going to make this one a little bit up. And uh, one thing that I'm going to add is the um, question if you forgot the password. So, so here we go. And this is going to be a hyperlink so that uh, users who actually forgot their passwords um, can uh, click over this uh, and uh, they're going to be redire redirected to another screen. So this uh, is actually, um, I think we're pretty much in good shape when it comes to this space. And uh, now I'm going to add a call to action to login and uh, I want this to be centered a, and uh, the button is going to have uh, the same color as uh, the other small hyperlink call to action and uh, going to add to the back this and make the login uh, just a little bit bigger and bolder and um, here is the main uh, login uh, button also going to make this, this forgot your password just a little bit up and um, yeah I think we're we're in pretty good shape for this 
um, you can always add some uh, text uh, at the bottom, maybe some uh, um, information which is relevant. So I'm just gonna add the gonna make this one a little bit smaller maybe in a grayish and um, this text can be um, all it can be used for for different things um, don't have like a, a, an idea on top of my mind for this but um, it can be like a, an extra an extra thing and one thing that uh, I think I'm gonna do is going to center this uh, this login section because thinking of it from uh, a user point of view, um, you're going to use this uh, on the iPhone. So probably you want the call to action to be a little bit uh, on uh, the bottom. So yeah, I mean, this is it for this uh, uh, tutorial. If you have any questions, just uh, drop a comment below and um, I'll get back to you. Thanks for watching.